let's see the another question question number 96 ecological niche of an organism represents the range of conditions that it can tolerate resources which it can utilize or the, its functional role in the ecological system of course ecological niche of an organism represents the range of conditions it can tolerate so this is correct and its functional role in the ecological system so it is also correct and the resources it can utilize but here in the question it is written as cannot so this is incorrect so only a and c are correct so the correct option for the given question is option number three let's move to the next question question number 97 in logistic growth a plot of population density n in relation to time t results in a sigmoid curve which finally shows an asymptote who went so this given graph shows the logistic growth over here and what does it mean in logistic growth there is increase in the population density up to a certain limit when the population density reaches this carrying capacity there is a asymptote carrying capacity is the maximum limit of the nature which can support the population growth now see here in case of this j-shaped curve or the exponential growth there is no asymptote logistic growth is the realistic growth because in environment the resources are limited they are not unlimited so this is the logistic curve here the population density is not increasing further population density is equal to the carrying capacity of the environment and at this point asymptote is reached so finally shows an asymptote when carrying capacity is equal to the population density see the first option intrinsic rate of natural increase is zero no it is not zero it is constant here so the correct option for the given question is option number two let's move to the next question question number 98 in which population interaction both the species are detrimentally affected detrimentally affected means negatively affected or the minus minus relationship see here in mutualism it is plus plus relationship what does it mean in this association both the species are benefited from each other so it is beneficial interaction commensalism it's a plus zero relationship where one species is benefited and the other species remains unharmed it has no effect so it is plus zero relationship between the populations predation is plus minus relationship where one species is benefited and the other one is negatively affected or the detrimentally affected but in the question it is asked that both the species are detrimentally affected in predation and the parasitism only one species is detrimentally affected in competition both the species are detrimentally affected so it's a minus minus relationship between the populations so the correct option for the given question is option number three let's move to the next question question number 99 from a virus infected plant we can obtain healthy plants by culturing it if we culture any meristematic tissue of an infected plant we can grow or we can culture the normal healthy plant because meristematic cells do not let virus to multiply fast so viruses cannot remain in the meristematic cells for a long period of time so the correct option for the given question is option number three let's move to the next question question number 100 match the column one with the column two and choose the correct option column a toti potency toti potency it's a capacity to generate whole plant from any cell it is seen in plants commonly so a matches with three option number one and four are ruled out this is how you can eliminate the options now scp is a single cell protein where spirulina is used so b matches with first option number three is also ruled out because b matches with first and the second option c fourth x plant part which is cultured 
the second callus it is unorganized mass of the cells so the correct option for the given question is option number 2